back to my channel what i have for you guys today is this simple no makeup makeup look hope you guys enjoy and now my loves just keep on washing i'm gonna be applying this eye treatment this is what it looks like i apologize if the video is a little dark my light stopped working so i'm kind of sad i'm really sad but i didn't want that to stop from recording this video for you guys so, and this is what it looks like you just pump it right here and the product comes out it does say that it's better to apply it on your finger and then apply it from there um and it says if you're gonna use the applicator just to be cleaning it after every use so i'm just taking a little bit and i'm putting it underneath the eyes remember to use your ring finger this is gonna prevent from doing too much pressure under your eyes especially because it's a super delicate uh, space that we have right here so you want to be really really careful with that area now to prep the skin i'm just going to be using this make it last spray and this is by maybelline this is what it looks like and i'm just going to be spraying this really fast and all you have to do is apply where you have your imperfections whatever you want to cover from your face but you guys can see i do have a lot of darkness on my skin and this happens to me because i am allergic to the sun so mean that means that i have to be using a sunscreen all the time every day i always forget to apply sunscreen so as soon as i don't apply any sunscreen and i go outside not being careful of course i get this dark uh patches on my face especially around around my nose so i do need to cover that up so for that i'm gonna be using the elf 16 hour camo concealer looks like this and again you just want to cover any imperfections that you have so i'm gonna be applying right here on the spots and of course around my skin and also right here on the forehead i also have a little spot right here the good thing about this concealer is that it has a great coverage so i'm also going to be covering my dark circles and that's so i'm doing for today so to blend all the concealer on my face i'm taking the uh wet and wild sponge this is what it looks like i love this thing i mean i've been using it every single day and i love how it applies and melts all the products on my face The good thing about this concealer is that it has a great coverage. Like you guys notice, I put a little bit of product and it basically covered my whole face. So yeah, you need just a little bit of this. I forgot how pigmented this is. I should have used less. The skin looks flawless, so that's okay. Now, once your concealer is so blended nicely throughout the skin, gonna be taking my wet and wild contouring palette looks like this like you guys can notice i love this thing i'm almost done with it anyways i'm gonna be taking the light shade right here and i'm gonna be setting my under eyes just so it'll crease and move around um i always have the problem that i always crease no matter what products i use if you have a good eye cream that you guys recommend please let me know down below in the comment section so i can give it a try with whatever is left on my brush i like to set the lid so it doesn't crease as well okay my loves and a tip that i can give you if you are on the oily side you can always just take a powder just a little powder to set the rest of your face my skin is a combination meaning i have oily and dry skin I don't have to set my whole face all the time so i'm just gonna leave it like this next if you want to bronze up your skin a little bit you can i'm just taking the wet and wild bronzer looks like this and this angle brush and i'm just gonna bronze the skin just a tiny bit you don't want to go to exaggerate it just because it is a no makeup makeup look so you want to look as natural as possible if you want to add a little bit of blood you can i think this looks perfect already so i'm not gonna do that moving on i'm just gonna uh, curl my lashes and add a little bit of mascara you guys already know which one is my favorite and this is the only mascara that works for me so yeah i recommend this a hundred percent you can always add a little bit of highlight if you want to be a little bit like 
you know showing a little bit shine from within you can add a little bit of highlight in this case i'm, I'm gonna leave my makeup like it is you want to go with something really natural and i'm gonna be using the wet and wild lip liner looks like this this is really close to my skin tone so i like to use it when i'm doing this simple makeup to finish up i'm gonna be using the dominic cosmetic lemonade lip lip gloss i'm gonna be spraying the maloney make it last one more time okay my loves and we are done this is what my face looks like it looks super stunning it looks super natural it's a simple makeup for every day um, now you guys notice I use a couple of products and my skin looks flawless. You can use this makeup every single day, especially if you're at home. You don't want to be looking all crazy every single day. Add a little bit of concealer, a little bit of powder, and you're good to go. I hope you guys enjoyed this short video. And please, before you leave, don't forget to subscribe, a like, and turn the bell notifications so you guys don't miss my next tutorials. I'll see you on my next one.